Hey guys, Super Metal Man Gaming back, and today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be showing you guys how to enchant items on Minecraft. Pretty simple. Uh, this I shouldn't even be giving you guys a tutorial on because it's that simple, but um, I haven't had any better ideas. Um, also, if you do not remember, videos every Saturday, uh, so keep in touch on Saturdays. Okay, so... Uh, I got a whole world picked out. Now what you're gonna need? Uh, bookshelves. First off, first off, to start the enchanting table up, you're gonna need bookshelves. Um, enchanting table. Um, what else do I need? Okay, you need an anvil. I need something else in here. Uh, an item to enchant. I'm just gonna do a sword. And a book, so probably best under here. So I'll just do protection four. And last but not least, lapis. All right. So now what we want to do is we have to set up our enchanting table or enchanting station. So do this. Okay. Well, before I get to that. Um, try to, like, if you try to do this, it only goes up to five, and if you keep adding lapis, it's not going to do it any better. Uh, so, you know, that's bad news. Uh, but when you start putting bookshelves there, you'll notice since I put one down, it will get, um... It gets better. Uh, the more bookshelves you put, the better it gets. Um, so, just pretty much, I think the max uh, that you really need is 15. So, you know, due to how much you have, really doesn't matter. If you want to save bookshelves, you know, just keep the corners open. But I'm a creative, so it doesn't really matter. All right, so now is where we get started. So place your anvil down. Uh, we'll get to that in a minute. Okay, so now what you do is you put a diamond sword in, um, a little lapis. Um, I'm on creative, so I don't have to put lapis in, but on survival you have to. So you will be needing lapis on survival, but creative it really doesn't matter. So we'll set that off to the side. Okay, so I could just do this, get a knockback sword. And it gave me... Bane of Arthropods, also, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, some of the enchant, if you don't know what the enchantments do, uh, you're just gonna have to like test them around with them. Uh, I will tell you like protection. It's like that's for armor, fire protection, armor, feather falling, armor, blast armor, projectile armor. I'm not sure what respiration does. Aqua efficiency armor. Uh, I think that's armor. Towards. So I think that's all armor. Flame one is actually for swords. I think. Uh, which is you know, a pretty good one. So I'll do that too. So you know. That's that. Um, let me do it with a. Something else. So I take an axe here. Put it in. Obviously I don't need lapis right now. So. And then uh, I got uh, efficiency four. I'm breaking three, fortune three, uh, which is really good. Fortune three gives you more items than you need. Like, say I mine diamonds. Obviously, you wouldn't mine diamonds with an axe. But if I had a pickaxe and I had fortune three and I mined diamonds, and let's just say I mined six of them, I'd probably get double each one. So that that would equal about twelve, uh, which is pretty good. Um, so uh, one more thing I wanted to point out before I get to the other part. If you put that in, and it says numbers here, 6, 13, 30. These are how many enchantment levels you're using. So, usually if you'd be on survival, so if I do slash game mode, survival, and where this bar is right here, this bar, uh, as soon as I get enchantments, it'll have a little number right here 
that number represents levels. And if I do that, I'll, obviously I don't have any, so that's why I can't enchant right now. But if I had 6, I'd be able to do that, not these two. If I had 13, I'd be able to do both of these. If I had 30, I'd be able to do any one of them. So that's that. Um... Go back into creative. Okay, so that's that's that. All right. So now what you want to do is well, let's see. Okay. Well, let's move on to the anvil now. So I think I've gotten over. You know, I got under control on this. Nothing hard to it. Pretty easy. Um. And I'd get fortune three, which is really good. Okay, so now we'll get to the anvil. Not the hardest thing in the world. Um, pretty easy. Alright, so if I get a sword, you'd put the sword there, you'd put that there, flame one, and you'd take it. So, enchantment calls two. Also, it costs enchantments, so it also it would also cost enchantment levels, just like it does right on the sides here. Except if you're looking for a specific enchantment, that's what you would use this for, enchanted book. So now it has flame on it, uh, which did not happen for some reason, but it has flame on it, which is actually a really good one. Um, also, if you guys want to know how to get enchanted books, that's pretty simple also. You just make a book, and I believe, honestly, I don't know, but I know it has to do something making a book, anything like that, but if you don't know how to do that, uh, look up another video. Uh, I don't really know that, but I do know all the other parts to enchanting, not that hard, pretty basic. Um, so yeah. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Videos every Saturday, plus weekday videos if I'm available for it. Um, so yeah, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys on my next video. Later.